New at 5, the city of Pittsburgh launched a program today offering businesses promotion on signs if they agree to pay their employees more. John Shumway is live downtown to explain. John. Yeah, Ken, they're hoping that this is just the beginning. These signs went up today. The city acknowledging Wiggle, Wiggle Whiskey. This is a company that's in the Strip District. This company, in their case, decided with their signs, they were going to promote their people. The latest batch of brew was mixing and distilling at Wiggle Whiskey in the Strip District. Meanwhile, the city started putting up promotional signs on bus stops for Wiggle. To promote them because they're paying a good wage. It's a city program to encourage employers to lift up those trying to exist on a minimum wage. I think it was almost something like 40,000 that are around the minimum wage right now. So, I mean, you're talking about having them have a couple extra dollars in their hands. To qualify for the publicity, a business must raise their employees from minimum wage to $10.10 .10 an hour, which is exactly what Wiggle did. We are a family owned and operated business and one of our core tenants is that we try to treat our customers and our staff like family. So living wages are of course an essential part of that. The promotional signs for Wiggle are up downtown in the Strip, Lawrenceville and Spring Garden. Gorelli hopes their efforts will speak to other employers. By making this very public statement we're hoping to say we're doing it. We think others can do this as well. Councilman O'Connor says they've already heard from others who want to take advantage of the opportunity. We've had businesses that already pay $16 an hour that want to do this because they're going to raise their employees' wages again. O'Connor says the program is making strides towards the ultimate goal of more employees making a better wage in the city of Pittsburgh. And these signs for Wiggle have been going up all day today, and as long as they keep their wages up, these signs will stay up for about the next six months at least. Live on Fifth Avenue, John Shumway, KDKA TV News.